Let my people go. Moses and the Exodus from Egypt. Many years after Moses was found in the basket, he grew up to be a strong and wise man. God had a special plan for Moses. One day, while Moses was taking care of sheep in the desert, he saw a bush that was on fire but was not burning up. When he went to look closer, God spoke to him from the bush. God told Moses to go to Pharaoh and ask him to free the Israelites, who were slaves in Egypt. God said, I have heard their cries, and I want you to lead them to a good and spacious land. Moses was scared at first. He didn't think he could speak to Pharaoh, but God promised to be with him and gave him signs to show Pharaoh's God's power. Moses' brother Aaron went with him to help speak to Pharaoh. When Moses and Aaron went to Pharaoh, they said, The Lord, the God of Israel, says, Let my people go. But Pharaoh was stubborn and would not listen. So God sent ten plagues to Egypt. The water turned to blood. There were frogs everywhere, and then gnats and flies. God sent sickness, boils, hail, locusts, darkness, and finally, the saddest plague of all, the death of the firstborn sons. Before the last plague, Moses told the Israelites to mark their doorposts with lamb's blood so that the plague would pass over their homes. The night became known as Passover. After the last plague, Pharaoh finally told Moses, Go, leave Egypt. So Moses led the Israelites out of Egypt. But soon Pharaoh changed his mind and sent his army to bring them back. The Israelites came to the Red Sea and were scared because Pharaoh's army was behind them. But Moses trusted God. He raised his staff God parted the waters of the Red Sea. The Israelites walked through on dry ground. When Pharaoh's army tried to follow, the waters came back together and they were washed away. The Israelites were free at last and they sang and danced, thanking God for saving them. Moses led them toward the land God had promised. This story from the Bible is about faith, courage, and deliverance. It shows how God can do amazing things to help his people and teaches the importance of standing up for what is right, even when it's difficult.